what's up damage squad it's your guest night damage and i'm back here with another video this is the first time you see my face on your screen make sure you make sure you guys go ahead and click the subscribe button smash the like button turn the bell notification on see with anything i post and last night you part of damage squad let's go back up right now and give this video a like make sure you guys go and watch my recent video i posted yes yeah go make sure you guys go watch my recent video i posted yesterday um so yeah, um, also make sure you guys go and check out my second channel, subscribe if you're not subscribed to it. I will try to post on that channel this weekend, hopefully. But today I have a lot of goodies from I Hope Revolution. So I have so much makeup here. I had I decided to get the Halloween eyeball highlighter, and this is so soft, y'all. Like I didn't know this was this soft. But not gonna review this that one today um i also picked up the blood the halloween blood chocolate palette because i know i got the um slime one and then the next one i picked up was another chocolate heart yeah i know if y'all don't know i do own another one that they came out with last year and they bought out a new one now of course there's three things in here that i already own and one thing in here no there's three things in here i don't own and there's one thing in here i already own so therefore one of these things in here is gonna be entered in a be gonna be put in a future giveaway but today i am going to be reviewing this right here which is the donut tray uh this is the donut palette so you basically get two eyeshadows one blush one highlighter and a bronzer and this set cost me 42 dollars oh yeah you also get beauty blenders in here um if y'all don't know they did came out with some donut palettes before let me just pull them out so you have these ones right here this one so yeah these were the five they came out with i said last year not last year these were the five they came out with during i would say during the month of my birthday they came out with these or maybe the month before but yeah they came out with these and i felt like they was gonna come out with more but i didn't know they was gonna put in the set but the first thing i thought of when i seen this it was Krispy Kreme donuts i've never been there before neither do i have one near me but that's what it reminded me of um i believe these are seven dollars each individually or five dollars each but um they don't sell these in a video right now you're going to get in a set most of the things that um i Heart revolution does is sometimes they won't post certain stuff on their instagram page so when you go on their website you will be surprised at the stuff you find like this was a surprise to me i didn't know they was going to do a christmas set like this by the way this is a christmas set but they launched it early but yeah even a heart one there's a chocolate vault too there's a random machine there's a whole bunch of christmas sets already out and they really haven't talked about it on the instagram page because i guess they want people to be surprised when they go on their website but that's how you gotta like pay attention and look closely to their website but anyways let me just dive into this and i got the chocolate heart thingy early this time the last time i believe i got it in the month of november and then the chocolate vault i got that in the month of february which i got it for 55 dollars so i think it's what they christmas gift said sometimes you want to wait to get it for a lot less because they do drop this price down eventually so sometimes you want to wait um I waited long enough until February and I got the chocolate vault set for $55 when the original price was $110. So, you don't have to wait that long. I mean, they will drop it. They will first drop it to like $80, then $70, then around $50. But, you can always wait. Like, the chocolate hot one, they, will, they always drop that to $30 eventually. So, um yeah as far as the donut one i'm not sure but i do know this um i believe the sets last up to like february or march and then after that they do put these individually so if you don't want the whole set you can get whichever one you want but as of right now 
these are like i guess you would say limited edition for right now and they don't sell them separately but here they are oh this smells so good right now y'all i'm gonna start off with this white one right here and yeah these do smell by the way and these are really soft this one is called Vanilla Frosting. Okay, this one is the highlighter. So that one's the highlighter. So let me just swatch it. Now the um, original ones I came out with, those or just eyeshadows. So. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, this one. Okay, this one is the eyeshadows. This one is Chocolate Caramel. You know, I gotta do this with all of them, like. And it's more like dark colors. I did watch a video on this to see what I was getting because sometimes when they first put this on their website, they don't exactly show pictures of what the inside looked like, which I feel like they should do that because you kind of play in a guessing game, like, oh my God, what am I gonna get? You know, but that's why it's good to watch some people's videos that already bought the thing so yeah okay let me just watch that shade right here i mean not bad colors but mm, i don't know and i know i was asked to do the one of the eye looks that i had on when i did that lip playlist video which I don't know if I'm going to re-upload that because it's taking like, as, this, as of right now, this is a recorded video, by the way. It's taking a while to edit, so like I got copyrighted for four songs in there. And it's taking a good minute, like, I don't know if I should re-upload it and then post it back again. But anyways, uh, yeah, so okay. This one is the blush. This is pink frosting. So this one looks so pretty though this one's kind of peeling right here though but so this is a blush and i'm gonna have to say this y'all i suck at using blushes oh wait a minute well this supposedly supposed to be a blush but it more look like highlighters but yeah that look like highlighters more than blushes but okay but yeah i suck at using blush like I have so many blushes here and I hardly use I only put blush on my face like that to be honest. Sometimes I don't do a full face on my face when I get on camera. Sometimes I just put on foundation and do my eyebrows and that's it. And I literally neglect my blush a whole lot. Okay, this one is called peanut butter and jelly. I smell jelly more than peanut butter. But you know. Do that, you know. <laughs> Oh yeah, um, all of these have mica in it. I know that. Um, these are cruelty free. Let me dip into this. Huh, interesting. When I just swatched this, it has like a bit of glitters as you can see. And when I swatched it, it looked like the glitter is just not there anymore. <laughs> I like how this one is looking, you know. This one is more colors that I can work with. Like, look at that. That is pretty. I like that one. So there's that one. And then the last one, which is this pink shade in the middle. Oh, that would make a great highlighter too, that shade. Okay. And then the last one would be the bronzer. So I'm sorry if this video going to be long, guys. This is a lot of palettes in here to review so come on come on out mm. this one is cinnamon sugar it doesn't really give me a cinnamon scent. wait it's it's a slightly cinnamon cinnamon scent but as you can see it's kind of like ew. okay yeah, so this is the bronzer, which is not a bad shade for me to use. I mean, I could use this. Um, oh, it's nice and soft, too. Yeah, I mean, it's a little bit light, but when you blend it in, I'm sure it will 
not be too bad. I, didn't, I don't have no contour bombs on my face right now, so I can use that. And then the last thing is the um the sponges. So at first I thought this was probably going to be like a donut sponge, but no, I'm going to take out one. It's basically sponges like this, and I don't even use sponges like this to be honest. So it's just like forty-two dollars. It's because this is in here, but okay. All right. So basically, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use both the eyeshadows on both eyes, this eye and this eye, and then let you guys know how it is. And then um, I'm gonna test out the highlighter, the blush, the bronzer, and yeah. I managed to create a look of this and I have to say these palettes are very pigmented don't let the small size fool you or whatever but I'm gonna start with this size so um one thing I didn't know about this this one I didn't pay attention to first of all by the way this one was coated with like some glitter I mean some gold glitter shifts or shimmer somebody. but this is more like a matte shimmer and this is like a, sh a matte matte shimmer this is, I think, is a matte shimmer too, but it's more showing up a shimmer on my, when I put on my crease. But I did went ahead with these two on my crease, and then I put this gold shade in the middle. Now for the peanut butter and jelly one, um, this is actually an all shimmer palette. I didn't realize that at first, but it is an all shimmer palette. But I still made a look with it because, you know, I've used an ocean my palette before to create an eye look. Just as simple as that. I know some people can't do that. That's okay. But I went ahead and used this shade right here for my crease. And then I did this shade too. And I put this shade right there. So, like I said, these palettes are very pigmented. Very nice. Work really good. Now, I'm going to test out this bronzer, so let's see how good this shows up. Okay, not bad, not bad. So, not pretty nice, gave me a nice, um, Oh, something in my mouth, but I'm not going to lie. So how some of it just slipped into my mouth. Um, it does taste sweet. Kind of remind me of Too Faced a little bit, cause I know that shit probably um tastes how it feels, but who knows? So this is not a bad bronzer I like it I tend to use bronzers and contours a lot Like I literally painted one But it's not hard for me to paint A bronzer and a contour To be honest So Yeah that, that was pretty nicely I like how that is Okay we're pretty nice now for the blush which more looks like a highlighter to me but we'll see i'm gonna use my pac-man brush you already know this i by the way when i did review this i didn't realize they had the pac-man thingy inside this thing so yes yeah, so i'm gonna start off with this light shade yeah this is more like a highlighter than a is this supposed to be a blush i think this is a highlight blush
Yeah, I think that's the uh, highlight blush. Okay, so yeah, that pretty worked without pretty nice, but this is more like a highlight blusher to me. Alright, now let's try the actual like highlight. The vanilla. This kind of look like my jewelry's place highlighted a little bit. You can see that. <laughs> Pretty nice, pretty nice. I'm telling you, like, Makeup Revolution holidays never really disappoint me. Like, they always just have that nice glow to them, which I think is nice. I mean, this highlight is nice, like a nice little natural highlighter, which I think is pretty cool. I thought they were just gonna come up with some new eyeshadows, but they already took it to the next level, you know, with this. Um, yeah, so I'm not going to be testing on the sponges because I don't really care for the sponges. Um, I'm going to put on some... Wait, let me just... Let me just take y'all along with me and just grab a lippy. So, it's opened. But yeah, I just put mascara on. I didn't feel like putting eyeliner on. Oh, this is sticky. Oh yeah, this is not bad. Like, I recommend y'all getting this. Like, this would be a, a great Christmas present to someone. You know, a great birthday present if, you know. Like, I honestly don't think this is bad. Like, this is really good. Like, if you don't want to get it for $42, you can always wait. I believe during the Black Friday sale, they'll probably drop the price down most likely. But this is some good quality stuff right here i see you make a revolution like y'all stepping up your game like i know they coming with like a bunny palette and a teddy bear palette in the future like 2020 so i can't wait to see what colors are gonna be in that but yeah so that is my view on this um let me know which guy which which side do y'all like better but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below. Subscribe if you're new. Hit the bell notification if you haven't. Find me on my social media. Send so me down below. And if you want to collaborate with me, you can email me or you can DM me on Instagram. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. You just pull it out in this picture. Bitch. Huh. Huh? Packing the mail, it's gone. Uh. She like I smell.